Your Spectrum internet going out doesn't have to derail your evening. In this video, we'll go over how to check your Spectrum internet connection and bring it back so you can continue with your day. Step 1. Check for outages in your area. The best way to do this is to visit Spectrum support site and start a chat which will prompt you to log in. You can inquire about outages in your area. If there is an outage in your area, there's nothing to do but wait. If you absolutely need the internet, you can turn your phone into a hotspot which depends on your phone and phone plan. Step 2. If there isn't an outage in your area, it's time to check the cables and lights on your router and modem. First, do a quick inspection of the connection between the internet port on the wall and the the internet port on your router. Do the same for the connection between the router and the modem. Next, check the lights. For a working internet connection, look for a solid internet light, which is usually the first light on the router. If you have cable internet, therefore a modem, look for a solid internet light there as well. A blinking light could indicate the modem is trying to connect. Step 3. Power cycle the router. While the lights can indicate an issue, that's not always the case. It's best practice to power cycle the router to ensure everything is working properly. Start by turning off the router and then unplugging it. Wait at least 30 seconds before plugging it in again. Why? Waiting 30 seconds clears the remaining electrical energy stored in the router's capacitors, which ensures the memory is cleared. Doing this can also help create a new connection to your ISP, which can solve the issue. After plugging the router back in, wait a few minutes for the lights to come back on. You should see a solid internet light. Do the same with your modem, power cycling the modem before the router. Step 4. Sometimes power cycling is not enough though. Your router may be bricked, it may have outdated firmware, or it may be possible that the router is overwhelmed by the number of devices connected. Regardless, it's best to reset the router completely. You can do this by pressing the reset button for 30 seconds or until the lights blink, though this can vary by router and modem. Resetting the router will restore the device to its original settings, reverting the network name and password to the original, which can be found on a sticker underneath the router. Simply set up the router again like you did initially. This should hopefully restore the router to working order. This also works for the modem. Step 5. Contact Spectrum Support When you've tried everything else, it's time to troubleshoot with the help of a Spectrum Customer Service representative. You can call or visit the support portal on Spectrum's website to fix your issue. There's always something you can do to restore your Spectrum internet, which is why 